Welcome to the shortwave radio channel and um, a lot of you have watched of course my um, video from last night. Last night I was using a Texan PL990 and I was actually um, decoding the weather chart like I am right now. And of course a lot of you are wondering how this is done. Well, uh, one of the first things you got to know is that the software that I'm using here is on Android. It's called HF Weather Facts. It's by Wolfie LLC. It's not a free software, but works really, really well in decoding HF weather facts. Um, decoding digital modes involves decoding sound. Digital modes are decoded with the sound that you hear. So the tones, the frequency, that's what makes the picture. So there's nothing, you know, mag magic about it. It's really just a set of tones and the frequency of the tones that create the picture that you see here decoding. Right now, I don't even have a cable hooked up. Just using the microphone of the tablet, as long as it's quiet, works really, really well. One of the things you want to do is when you decode HF weather facts, you'll have to be 1.9 kilohertz below the main frequency. So for example here, the frequency for Boston on this um, 9 megahertz frequency is 9110. This is what you'll see when you see HF weather facts frequency for the transmission. But to give the proper tone, you have to set your radio at 9.108.1, 1.9 kilohertz lower. Now, if you don't have that uh, luxury of extra digits, a lot of portables are not that precise, what you'll do is you'll just tune 9.108 and you'll play with the BFO so that the tones actually set right. For the tones to set right, you see here there's a set of lines. The lines of the audio, and you can see that my talking actually impacts it, needs to be within the boundary of that square. So if you look when it's very strong, you'll see that when I don't talk, the actual lines of the HF weather facts is within that box. So as long as they're within the box, they're going to decode well. If they're outside the box, you'll see that there's be varying levels of gray or even no decode at all, depending on how off you are. So tuning precisely is important. And of course, you're inside the box automatically if you're 1.9 kilohertz below the frequency. There are apps for um, iPhones, uh, iPads also. There are apps for Windows, uh, FLDG, for example, for Windows, Linux, Mac, decodes weather facts really really well and we're going to actually show you that we're going to go here and i'm going to start fldg and fldg will pick up the sound we're going to make sure that the mode is weather facts ioc 576 and we'll make sure that the lines at the bottom match you have to make sure the lines at the bottom match the actual signal and that's why you'll see that there's the coding of the map as you see here and then you have want to make sure that the black bar is at the edge on the left or on the right but one of the both if possible and you'll want to fix slant if it's not properly decoding now now it's moving because I'm doing too much stuff on the computer and it's kind of breaking apart the picture, but usually you'll have a good decode there. So
So every single digital mode you'll want to decode is always audio frequencies. It's what you hear that is decoded. And depending on the mode, there'll be a different space to pinpoint the signal. And that's what you gotta find, where to pinpoint the signal correctly. So this is the first in the series, uh, in the beginner series, where I'm gonna show you different di digital modes, how to decode it with different software, how to adjust it and so on. Also in different ways, not always with the phone like this, uh, some with the screen recorder. So I hope that in, in, uh, it's, it, you, you like it and that it helps you kind of understand how to do it. Um, I will also make a video with the latest list of weather facts frequencies that's available by uh, actually NOAA, the uh, National Oceanic Atmospheric Administration, has a list of worldwide uh, weather facts stations. I'm going to share that in a separate video. So, hope you enjoyed the videos. If you do, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.